Today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different than what I usually do. Well, I guess I actually do do some crazy things on the channel. I like to do a lot of fun little videos, just really just for fun. And today we have this Reddit thread. This was brought to my attention by the creator of the thread, Silver Beretta, on Twitter. So I thought, why not just take a look at this in a video and share this with you guys? Because it's kind of crazy. Now. For a little bit of backstory, Ultra Perfect Cell is something that originated in one of my Q and A's, and it's actually here. The source to it is actually listed on this thread. It's the exact Q and A. It's the exact timestamp. So let's take a listen. Uh, every superhero combined in every anime plus Whis, Vados, and all twelve gods of destruction versus Ultra Perfect Cell, which is Cell with a mastered times. 900 quintillion SSJ God, SSJ 9 Golden Form, SSJ has a multiplier of 7 million. Um, whatever the f*** this second half is, it seems like that's kind of hands down the winner. Uh, I don't give a f*** what superhero. Like, what the hell, man? That... That's your winner. I thought that was amazing that the guy even... Number one, maybe remembered where it was or anything like that. But let's get right into this, how about that? Ultimate Perfect Cell, aka UPC, is a Dragon Ball hypothetical fan character predominantly developed in a series of Ask FM questions to the Dragon Ball Focus YouTube channel, Dragon Ball Nation. He has gained minor notoriety on the channel due to the propensity of absolutely ridiculous fan wanked power ups and abilities he is apparently capable of. As he does not exist in any sort of detailed medium, all judgments of power are established through the words of his anonymous creator's questions, as well as the host Josh's deduced answers. In short, this is 100% word of God. <laughs> the wording here is, is, is like candy. It's amazing. I love how this is written. While we have not seen any of UPC's feats or abilities visually, we are able to form judgments based on what is given by these sources. Note that this character is extremely powerful and would probably not cause any good debates this side of the Sudgeverse. I don't really know what that last part is, I'm not familiar with that, but maybe some of you do. Decent knowledge of Dragon Ball's various transformations, characters, power scaling, and abilities are needed to understand the silliness of this character. Although it is sometimes not the most accurate source of information, links to the Dragon Ball Wiki will be given for a general overview of previously established terms. Okay, I just want to say the thing about Dragon Ball Wiki, it's pretty bad a lot of times, but it can be good for quick information if you know what's true and false, I guess. It's good to like maybe refresh things. It's in a pretty neat order, I guess, I guess you could say, but there's a lot of not good info on there. So physical strength. Power level is stated by the creator to be beyond infinite. Later changes to far beyond infinite. I mean, that's... I if, if he can do it, then he... You know what? Go for it. I'm not even going to argue. Stated by the creator to be able to destroy 900 billion universes is under one second. Well, if his power is infinite, wouldn't he just be able to destroy infinite in one second? I don't really know. Stated by the creator that Ultimate Perfect Cell doesn't have to train because he gets 90 times stronger every half a second. This is a con- <laughs> The detail in here is- is- is too much for me. This is contradicted later with the creator now stating Ultimate Perfect Cell gets 100 quintillion times stronger every second. Durability, stated by the creator to have the ability to survive a universe-sized a universe explosion at less than 1% power. Speed, I think this top line is, well this top line is actually a duplicate of the, the strength, so I guess it's a typo. Anyways, move on to the next one. Stated by the creator to be 9 times faster than the speed of time. What the hell does that even mean? Apparently fast enough that he goes full speed. He, if he goes full speed, he would go into another area in time. Whether that is referring to time travel is unknown. Also stated by the creator to be 9 billion times faster than reality. <laughs> <Yes. clears throat> 
<clears throat> Special abilities, Kaioken, ultimate Kaioken times infinity, perfect Kaioken, a Kaioken that has no problem controlling no matter how high you go. So it's just, it's like a mastered Super Saiyan, but it's Kaioken, that's kind of crazy. Transformations, all established by the creator in this video. 900 quintillion times, it, but possibly a cow can multiply as it's just a direct multiplication of power. So it's just a multiplier. There's no, it doesn't say what the power up is. This guy knows, he sourced out more info than I could even think of this character. Super Saiyan. <laughs> Compose yourself, Josh. Compose yourself and read it. Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan 9, Super Saiyan Blue, SSJ9 has a multiplier of 7 million. He also has the golden form, of course, and he also has form mastery. So this is based off the established rules of Super Saiyan Grade 4. This means that each transformation has none of the drawbacks that they would otherwise have. So he can master any form, really. Um, Ultra Perfect Cell is stated to be immortal. Time travel, possibly, if the speed feats are true. And a reality beam, stated by the creator that if it comes within 999 quintillion feet of you, you will not exist. Then these are just various matchups that I know I've said before, and it, it's who would win and, and, and in what fight, so... Ultimate Perfect Cell would beat every superhero combined in the every and every anime plus Whis Vanos and all 12 Gods of Destruction. And I'm gonna guess these video links are all these are all links to the videos where it's stated. That is an immense amount of effort <laughs> that this guy went through. Uh, Ultimate Perfect Cell would beat all of Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, GT, and Dragon Ball Super combined. Ultimate Perfect Cell would beat Zeno. Ultimate Perfect Cell will beat Superman Prime, stated it twice? I guess I did. I mean, if it's here, it's gotta be true. Ultimate Perfect Cell outstrips Super Hyper Sonic in speed, who is stated to be able to travel 80, 000, or 8,000 times the speed of light. And it says that I'm unsure whether or not Super per or Ultimate Perfect Cell could beat Mastered. I mean, just by the name here, it's a little bit crazy. Mastered God SSJ9 Billion Vegito then later states Ultra Perfect Cell is stronger than SSJ God 100 Quintillion Vegito. I mean, <laughs> listen, I might contradict myself a little sometimes, but I was, well, I mean, clearly, I mean, Mastered God Super Saiyan is something completely different from Super Saiyan God, so obviously I wouldn't be sure about that. The real kicker states that Ultimate Perfect Cell would lose this to this monstrosity only if the cre only for the creator to state Ultimate Perfect Cell's power is far beyond infinity. Later in the video, confusing Josh and whether he would lose or not. So, you guys need to check this whole thing out. You need to click the links, uh, look at all the sources, look at all the work this guy put himself through. All of these links, all everything here. It's amazing, and I feel incredibly thankful that anyone would bother putting in work like this just for a laugh, and, you know, didn't ask me to do a video or anything like that. I just thought, like, this is so crazy and so hilarious, and I know some people are going to think it's stupid, and that's fine. I think it's hilarious, and my channel, I'll show you guys what I want to show you, and the people that want to see it will watch it, so please check out the links down below. Please show this guy some love because this is an amazing thing and it's pretty funny i think um if you guys enjoyed it as well let me know down below hopefully we don't get more floods of ultimate perfect cell questions after this but we're probably gonna maybe we'll get some okay if we get an ultimate perfect cell fan fiction i'll read it on the channel i have done a fan fiction reading in a very long time we need to get back to those but silver beretta this was amazing thank you so much for making this and you know, let's see if we get some more fan-related stuff from the channel or anything that's been said or... Hell, why not some more Ultimate Perfect Cell, right? Because he is literally above infinity. 
So, guys, like, thank you guys for watching this video. And, of course, I'll catch you guys later.